Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Let's start with the news today. Russian violated obligation under international humanitarian law, says Human Rights Watch. US-based organization Human Rights Watch said Russian force had uh, violated their obligation under international humanitarian law not to uh, conduct indiscriminate or disproportionate attack that harm civilians. The command come after eight civilians were killed over the weekend while fleeing the Russian army advance. For several hours on March 6, 2022, Russian forces are bombarded uh, an uh, intersection on a road that hundreds of civilians were using to flee the Russian army advance in northern Ukraine to Kyiv, the HRW said in a statement Thursday Tuesday. About a dozen uh, Ukrainian security force members and at least two military vehicles were at the intersection during their attack, but they were vastly uh, outnumbered by the uh, large number of fleeing civilians. The statement said, citing uh, witnesses, uh, HRW added that over recent talks between uh, Russia and Ukraine have failed to uh, establish safe route of uh, evacuation and urge all parties involved to uh, take on feasible steps to remove the uh, civilian population from the uh, vicinity of uh, fighting of or uh, military objects. Some contact several attempts to evacuate uh, civilians during a temporary ceasefire have failed uh, with uh, Western leaders accusing uh, Russian forces of continue to target pre-approved routes. Almost all of uh, Russia's proposed routes are out of uh, Ukraine lead to Russia or its close ally Belarus, which Ukrainian authorities describe as unacceptable. On Monday, uh, Ukraine uh, ambassador for the uh, to the UN accused Russia of a blocking attempt to evacuate civilians, adding it was uh, appalling that Russian troops were opening fire on uh, evacuees after both countries had uh, allocated uh, certain roads to be uh, utilized as uh, evacuation corridors. This is the end of our news today. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.